Welcome back to season seven. Some days here. Well, it's that time to get ready to take off, start heading to the west. Got to get all my stuff together. Today we're going to talk about the generator. We have a Champion 3100 2800 uh, inverter generator. I've had this almost three years now. I want to go through it and give you an update on it because we all know when you buy something you want it to work and you want it to last. This generator's been up and down the road over 15,000 miles and uh, it's been working really good for us. So come on back. We're going to go through this quick, show you what we used to power Maddie. <laughs> Thanks for coming back. Uh, if some of you are new to the channel, make sure you uh, subscribe and hit the uh, bell down there so you can get notified when we put out videos. We're getting ready to take off for season seven. Uh, we have Maddie here, our 42 uh, foot uh, San Antonio version of the Landmark and uh, by Heartland. And we power it when we're boondocking and out in remote areas with the Champion. Uh, 3100 watt inverter generator. Now this is a 7553.7i and it is set up uh, really to work with RVers. If you haven't seen my previous videos, I think it was season two, maybe episode 26, we went into a full deal with this. I just kind of want to update you today on uh, where we're at and how this generator has performed for, for us. Um, as you can see, it's got the TT30 plug that you can plug in your 30 amp receptacle right from your rig right into here. Uh, will it power a whole rig? Uh, absolutely not in some cases. In some cases it will. So it depends on your rig. But this generator has been up and down the road all over the Tetons, the bitter roots, all the way down up 101 in the back of this truck. So you know the roads that we're dealing with today are not the smoothest. So, so far, this has handled up and met every expectation that I could even want. Um, it's got the on-off gas. You've got your switch that you can turn things off and on with. Uh, it's got the Ocano mold. And what I like best is the remote start. We use this. We can sh turn it on and turn it off inside the RV. So, let's just see what happens. Okay, so you hit the button one time. Hasn't been run for a while. It will automatically restart itself, I think up to five times, and it'll choke itself. So you don't have to worry about that. But it's been a great little uh, generator for us. been sitting up for a little while but this is what I like about it I don't have to sit here and pull on the handle pull on the handle this remote start if you have a choice get it it'll start I'm not worried about it Probably ran it out of gas last time I used it. I usually like to do that when I uh, put it up for a little while. But uh, we've had this. We've used it, uh, as you've seen, in uh, Bryce Canyon. We used it for a whole week. Um, it's really performed well with us. It'll run one of our air conditioners on this rig here. Um, so, so far, we haven't had any problem with it whatsoever. Until now.
was, I ran it out of gas last time. It just takes a while to get it back in there. And as you can tell, we're standing right here, right next to this. This is probably three years old, and it's still pretty quiet. So when I put it in the back of the truck, flip the tailgate up, you really can't hear it. Just a little bit, that's all right. But it's got your adapters, it's got your two 120-volt plugs that you can plug in here. It's got your DC plug. Like I said, I've used this generator for a lot of places, and now they depend on it. And so far, making a big investment in a generator of this kind, you're always worried about what's it going to do. And so far, this champion, 3100, has done some days here a really good job. So thanks along for coming along. We're fixing to get ready to get down the road. I'm um, going to get all my stuff ready to go. So this is the first step that was going to get the generator ready. And we'll be on the road showing you some more things, some more destinations. Kim's in the RV getting everything ready. We're getting everything packed and restored and get back on the road. So if you're first time here on the channel, make sure you subscribe. Hey, comment down below. Tell me what kind of generator you got. Or do you have one of these and how is it working? Thumbs up if you got time. We appreciate it very much. And stop the madness, start the adventure. We'll see you down the road. Some days here. You gotta love it. <laughs>